So guys, welcome to a new Genshin Impact video. Guys, in this video, we are going to talk about and also I'm going to show you the gameplay of Ryo Thessaly, the upcoming 5 shark character in Genshin Impact. Mioyo just announced Ryo Thessaly on the Twitter. So what we know so far about Ryo Thessaly, he's going to be a 5 star Cryo Catalyst user and he's going to be the full nuke DPS character. Same as the uh, Lene. Lene is also a full nuke pyro character, no reaction, nothing, just pure nuke and pure raw damage pyro character. So Ryo Thessaly also going to be a pure raw damage cryo character, nuke cryo character, same as Ayaka and Ganyu that we have previously in the game. In simple words, he's going to be a cartless character, so gameplay is going to be very similar to what uh, Sino, Sino and Hezu does. Sino and Hezu both do the fist fighting. Hezu properly do the fist fighting, the you know punches and the legs using the punches and the legs. Ryo Tesli actually punches the enemy like he's actually wearing some time car type of glass uh, gloves on the hand and he's actually punching in the real time. In normal attack, Ryo Tesli is doing the fist fighting and also in elemental skill. His same doing the face fighting, punching the enemy, but faster. In elemental skill, he becomes a little faster and normal attacks got buffed. Same as what we got uh, with the Sino. Sino also does the normal attack in the elemental burst faster and better. The same going to happen with Ryo Thessaly, but Ryo Thessaly is gonna get the buffs in the elemental skill. So in the elemental skill, he's gonna do the face fighting, the normal attack, the charge attack faster and with more damage with a buff in elemental burst he's gonna deploy and sword type of a point. thing Looks like the situation he's gonna do again. the one time damage like a uh, sword type of a thing which gonna deals a huge amount of aoe damage aoe cryo damage in the elemental burst so this is what the rio thesley is looks like uh, maybe he's gonna change it in the future that like, all the information i have is uh, this is this only information i have sorry i can't show you the gameplay because that's gonna be the mood spoiler or the spoiler of the game because i don't want to show you the gameplay because that's not the company allows but yes this is a gameplay very similar to what hezu and sino does sino also do the fist fighting all the punches and all in the elemental burst same as the hezu does in the normal attacks he's going to be a super fun full dps character uh, the artifacts are already in the game that's got going to be very good for the Rio Thessaly you can start grinding right now I can I'm gonna make a separate video for the grinding part of the Rio Thessaly so keep connected to my channel I'm gonna upload a separate grinding video for Rio Thessaly right. for you now he's going to be a full DPS new cryo character he's gonna be a super it. strong and super fun character and he's from Fontaine, of course. One more thing I'm gonna tell you about the Rio Thessaly. When HP falls, he's gonna get the more damage. So similar concept to what uh, Hu Tao and Xiao has. Uh, when you get into the elemental burst of Xiao, the HP keeps on falling. When you activate the elemental skill of Hu Tao, the HP falls. Same concept going to happen with, with Rio Thessaly. Also, Rio Thessaly is purely based on the HP percentages. The higher you're gonna have the HP, the more you're gonna deal, deal the damage. The higher he's gonna, f uh, you know, depleting his HP, the higher he's gonna deal the damage. The same concept that Hu Tao ha Hu is currently having in the game. So thank you guys for this video. I hope you like this video. Uh, you'll all get the idea about the Ryo Thessaly in the game. We'll meet in the next video. If you like this video, please hit the like button and do share this video with your friends and subscribe to my channel for more Genshin related videos in the future. We'll meet in the next video guys. Till then, bye bye. Take care.